hello guys welcome back to my channel today we'll be learning how to cut this beautiful off sleeve you can make it short or long any length of your choice please subscribe to this channel if you're new like and share this video okay so to start with my fabric is on fold sorry guys about the camera it's not that bright the weather is um cloudy okay. my fabric is on fold i folded into four because I'm cutting the two sleeves together. So the width is my armhole, which is 8.5 plus one inch seam allowance and extra eight or seven inches. Okay. My armhole, which is 8.5 plus extra one inch for sewing allowance and extra seven inches. And my length is 10 plus extra three inches and 1.5 inch for the elastic casing okay you can use any length of your choice then make sure to add three inches extra to form the offness at the down part and you add 1.5 for your casing so here i'm marking out the eight inches i'm using for my i'm marking out the seven inches extra i added to this um fabric okay I'm marking the extra seven inches and I'm going to take it down. I'm going to mark the line straight like this. Okay. So from that point, I'm going to take at the edge here, I'm going to mark my sleeve cap, which is 3.5. And from this point, I'm going to curve down to this point. Okay, so from that line, I'm going to draw like an S to get to meet the sleeve cap and our sleeve is ready. As simple as ABCD. Okay, so this down part, I'm going to fix elastic there and it will gather the down part. And I'm also going to, as you can see, my fabric is on fold. I fold it into four. Okay, I fold it into four and I'm going to gather this upper part and elastic will gather the down part so let me measure my armhole to be sure it corresponds so my armhole is 9.5 and what I have here is 10.5 so as you can see I have extra one inch allowance for joining of my sleeve another method of cutting this sleeve is to measure your round armhole and then you're going to curve it like this you start from this point to measure whatever you have you measure it this way okay adding one inch for your seam allowance did you see that and you're going to use your chalk and mark the tip and then you curve to meet to that point that is another way of cutting this okay but I'm not going to use that I'm going to use the first method I used okay as you can see you cut this through and is ready that is this other method okay but for the first method you mark this line and mark your sleeve cap and then you curve okay you mark your sleeve cap here and then you curve from here to meet to the sleeve cap which is the method i'm going to use so this is the one i'm cutting out now okay you mark your sleeve cap and then you curve okay so i'm going to cut this out so if you want your sleeve to be full you need to use lining so that it will look voluminous or you can add extra more than this seven inches i added you can add more than the seven inches you can use 10 you can use 12 if you want it too very full you can use up to 10 okay and you turn it with your lining but i'm not going to use lining to turn this this is a crepe fabric and we'll be using it like that okay i'll not be using lining to turn this so i'm going to sew from the first edge to the other edge of the armhole okay so here it is i have already gathered the upper part with my gather stitch as you can see you gather up to your armhole measurement and i've already fold my elastic casing here make sure that your fold is up to will contain the half an inch elastic okay so i'm going to use this safety pin to insert my elastic the elastic is 
um, length is your round biceps or elbow anywhere your sleeve is getting to you cut out the elastic the, with the measurements if your round elbow is okay um bicep is 10 you minus two inches from it to get your elastic that means you'll be using nine inch for your elastic okay so i'm going to sew this point i'm using pin to hold it in place so i'm going to stitch there so that it will not move and i'm going to gather i mean insert the remaining elastic to the elastic casing using my safety pin okay all right so i'm done doing that i'm going to sew here and also sew the two the other edge just to secure it and i'm going to turn it over like this wrong side facing right side facing right side and i'll shape my sleeve okay i'll shape my sleeve with the allowance i added okay and you fix your sleeve to your armhole and it's going to look like this so this is the second sleeve i've already fixed it to the dress i am making okay so make sure you gather up to your armhole measurement okay don't gather excess or too small make sure you gather up to your armhole measurement okay and it's gonna be like this after you shape all right Thank you guys for watching and this is the final look like and share this video subscribe to this channel if you're new and see you in my next tutorial bye